Hello, YouTube, and welcome back into our tourism game with Ethiopia. We've got to keep our churches all churchified here. Because otherwise we don't get the tourism. Same thing as traders. I mean, fair. Maybe. There are two schools of thought. Uh-oh. 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 Lay, lay, lay it on us, Rosie. I, 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 I am, is it, you know what, never mind. I'll keep my unpopular opinions to myself. I'll just keep my unpopular opinions to myself. Um, one, two, three, yeah. Don't see how we're getting other, I mean, I could get out there and explore, but I think barbs, you know? Barbs are like a thing. So we just pick based on yields. Been within a few feet of black bears, big cuddly things. <laughs> noted, peppermint, noted. Better as woods. Okay, we can get our seaside resorts now. Eight turns. And then what are we doing here? Anything in particular? I just think it's explaining. I, I just think it's cheating when you get to look at the camera and explain your jokes. That's that's my problem with the office. Like you can you can write any joke you want and then be like and like yeah, it's cheating. But that's fine. There's still joy to be had there. I liked it a lot like back in the day, but um it's not like a community for me where I can like watch it multiple times. Market seems fine. What's my next uh, park? 1700 already? Oof. Curb is great, Paisley. Curb is pretty great. All right. What, what shall we do now here? Gonna clear all this. And then that was a mine. I want to get rid of that. Ancient barbarians this time. So we have classic and ancient barbarians. How is this still going on? So we want to go to misclick here. That way we can hopefully extend future trade routes, but all right, what's going on in the great people realm of the world? Not too much. This has to be a good amount of tourism, indeed. Uh, only 20. That one's 22. 
20 also. Seven turns on the era. No, <laughs> I'm so close to clearing it. It was right there. It was right there. Um, I'm actually doing, I, I hope to remember to do that this weekend, fast forward. I've, I've thought of some fun things to, to spend channel points on. We, we did a poll, or I got some feedback from Chad as far as how many channel points are out there uh, at the moment. And so that was pretty enlightening. I can't ever be a park, so it's a fine hermitage. 10 turn great lighthouse is kind of hilarious. Let's try for that. Five more era score needed. We have six of two housing. I'm nowhere near Golden Gate Bridge tech. We went the top half of the tech tree. So I, I won't really have that option. Could be getting uh, converting our faith into archaeologists too. <laughs> just it just doesn't end <laughs> and he he's he's blocking me just just gonna pretend it's not happening just gonna pretend it's not happening it's not happening nothing's happening everything's fine I considered nuking the barbs. I've considered not having this many barbs. Um, that would be nice. I think I want to use this here. Get rid of that mine. Six turns on the era. So what's weird here is I think I'm not I'm gonna forego my my park at the moment. Um, I think I'm just gonna convert the rest of this faith into a bunch. Well, I could build builders though, is the thing. Can you chop wood to plant wood? No. Uh, you, if you plant wood, it says it's a second growth, and second growth forests uh, do not give you any production from chopping. I still think I'm going to need a massive amount of builders here. And then at 500 faith per turn, like we're, we're getting a new national park every five, four to five turns. And this is just so many builders. Last one for now. Rip. Capture. Oh. Give me that home. 
classic us now to pair with our classic uh, barbarians. Five turns on the era here. You know what? I actually, this engineer should be for, for this, right? I think so. Oh, I can't clear that, huh? Okay, well then I guess I have to do this one. First time I stepped All right. into the rooftop get another the policy palace. slot here not too bad especially since I don't think I'm switching into democracy we'll probably close out the game in theology just so we don't get the uh, penalty for having that government never visited before and if we have extra slots then then we're we're, we're good to go I don't have to worry too much about it And that gets us to our golden age. So we are good to go. Faith is getting pretty great. And then we're about to unlock Christo. We've already been in the modern era, so we don't have to worry about the uh, era score there. Finished Patala. And we're going to get ready to chop all the things. I think I'm going to go pretty heavy archaeologists. This is pretty sweet. We could also run the gold. I think this is right. Four turns. Zoomed! Hey, 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 now there's a raid! Holy cow, chat, defend! What is happening? My goodness, we're being overrun by heathens! Heathens and barbarians, go to war, chat. Go to war. <laughs> That's so much spam, you guys. Wow. <laughs> I'm impressed. Welcome in. Thank you so much, Zoomed. Thank you for the giant raid. And, I, uh, man, I've never been raided quite like this. <laughs> very, very cool. Thank you all so much. How is your stream? How's it going? Everybody go follow my friend, Zoomed Master. He's good people. Hello, Ms. Lady Sunfire. It's good to see you too. <laughs> so much spam. Welcome in, you all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate you being here. Fan freaking tastic. Um. Okay. I know. I know. Seriously, seriously, Ms. Lady Sunflower. It's like, it's like really getting me down. <laughs> it's all good. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome in. Uh, I'm the Game Mechanic. If you don't know me, I stream Civ 6 all the time, um, and it's kind of my jam. So if you like this game, hop on in. We'll be we'll be streaming tomorrow. We're going to be playing some Project Humankind. Uh, it's a new 4X that's coming out next year, which is pretty cool. And uh, yeah, welcome in. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate the raid. Appreciate the raid. Uh, seaside resorts all over here, I think. Lots and lots of seaside resorts. Tourism at the cost of a builder charge. Big fan. Big fan. <laughs> uh, 
Um, I'm gonna make some uh, uh, intro videos. Uh, I I suggest checking out Saxy Gamer, Potato Mick Whiskey, uh, some of the other YouTube folks. Um, they've got better they've got better proper guides than I do at this point in my uh, streaming career. I've got a lot of skills to develop before I'll make anything as cool as they do. But that's a, a goal of mine for for soon. For soon. So three and two, meaning this should be a woods, and then we enable the other seaside resort here. We are late on in our game. Uh, turn 160, we're generating tourism. That is our key to victory here. We have 18 of 202 tourists needed in order to win this. Four turns on the era. Found our golden. It's always nice. Uh, does losing Geneva matter? Benjamin Franklin Probably May. not a ton. But we can also just take it back. Yeah, it's, it's a good amount of science, I think. See you, Dad. Thanks for hanging out. So this is Woods. This is Seaside Resort. Awkward, awkward. Hopefully we can beautify that enough. What happens if you chop the wood? Will the seaside resort just generate less tourism? Yes. Um, there, the gold you get from seaside resorts is equal to the appeal of the tile. So we have a breathtaking tile here at four. We're get, we have four gold, and so we are generating four tourism from the Seaside Resort. Now, we are going to double that soon. And if we get, uh, if, if there is time to get Eiffel Tower, that'll, that, that'll add two, which will then double um, and add four more tourism per resort. So neat stuff happening if we can get to that point. Park, park, seaside resort. Like they don't even need a theater square here. I, you know what? Who knows, Oedipusaurus? I mean, it's not coming out until next year. And so, so much could change between now and then. It's kind of hard to plan around it. really want there's 10 faith out of the meeting house okay all right i'll build it then i'll build it then that seems okay is there any app or software to keep track of everything we're at the point where, where you, if you haven't if you're not familiar with civ 6 it's going to be hard for you to keep up at this stage of the game we are we are well established i'm doing very very specific things uh, for our for our victory condition, um, so it's definitely going to be uh, a, a bit of a struggle if you're not familiar. Um, what I will s say, oh God. <laughs> why do I keep doing that? I don't know. Um, what I will say is we're playing an appeal based tourism game. Um, so basically, my big goal is planting 
building a lot of builders, planting a lot of woods. Um, woods add appeal into the land. Appeal gives us faith from Earth Goddess, but also beautifies spots for um, for for uh, national parks, which give us tourism, and seaside resorts, which give us tourism. Oh, okay. Sorry. So seven tourism on that, 105 already. What's our original wonder here? We got Apadana, although it's holding great works. Yeah, the great works are worth more than the Apadana itself, but it doesn't differentiate the total thing. Happens if you get surprise ward. Uh, we're friends and allies with everybody on the map. So that shouldn't happen. And we're booking it to computers where we're going to get a 25% boost to tourism. Oh, great lighthouse. We don't care about that. That's fine. That's okay. So looking at the, the uh, wonders we have available, Oxford is slightly interesting, although probably not super worth it. Uh, on this list, there isn't much that I want. I basically just want Broadway and Christo and Bolshoi. We'll go tech Bolshoi in a second. And is this the last turn of the era? Two turns, two turns. Uh, and we want to get more builders. I'll be a little bit more picky about where I buy them. Try to give them to the cities that we want to be improving here. At the game mechanic, shoot out a civ related question and I'll gift a sub for first. Who knows? <sighs> it right. Um, okay. Ask a civ related question to chat. Ask a civ related question to chat. All right, BB. Hold on. I'm up. For, I'm up for the challenge. I'm up for the challenge. Florida man, thank you so much for the nine months. Welcome back with that Prime sub. Hello and thank you there. for the sub, baby. That is exciting. Thank you for the nine months of support. Welcome on back. It's good to have you here. Appreciate it a lot. Um, don't really need broadcast towers. We'll want some spots for, for great um, works of music, so I guess it's fine to, to grab here. <laughs> um, it's it's going to be hard to ask something that isn't just super Googleable. I ask. Hey, Quarian. I am still on today. How you doing, buddy? How you doing? I'm um, trying to think of civ-related questions. It's funny because I've I've designed most of a Jeopardy game for Civ, um, which I would still like to make happen at some point. Um, so I have a lot of these questions written down, but now that uh, now that I'm on the spot, <laughs> not, not as easy to come up with uh, questions. Really? <laughs> That's interesting, Florida man. <laughs> Did you really, Abed? That's exciting. <laughs> no, that's yeah, that's too easy. What's like the best pantheon? That stuff's easy. Um I, I, all right, this is cheating if you were here earlier when we were talking about it. But the Lavra has three unique abilities on it. What are they? Got to plant woods there. That's Blue Wings has one of them. So I've got that too. There you go. Now I got it. Got all three. And Swirly got it too. Well done, you guys. Well done. 
That's fun. The correct answer is uh, extra tiles for great people expended within the city, half cost, and extra great people points. Well done. Well done. All right. For the time being, I'll add the woods to make this tourism a little bit better. <laughs> nice, Swirly. I love that. So, trade routes to another sieve are worth a 25% modifier to tourism. We're trying to maximize that, but it seems like we have all the ones that we can. So, I guess we just pick for yields. Thank you. Did you finally deal with something, AIs? All right, two turns on the era, five turns on computers. Yeah, that's a good one too, Paisley. Here's a, yeah, here's another here's another fun uh, good um, trivia question. Uh, what is one thing that all wonders? do for you. If you don't read the Every newspaper. single one. It's the exact same thing. It is one thing that all wonders do for you. <laughs> ah, yeah, I guess three I guess three correct exam uh, answers, right? Tourism, appeal, and two extra tiles for the city that built it. Release dopamine into my brain. That may be true as well. <laughs> that may be true as well. Yeah, it's not a culture bomb. You just get two extra tiles. Yep. If you complete a wonder in a city, that city will immediately expand its borders by two tiles. Little known fact. I think I'm happy where we're at here. They awaken Sean Bean from his slumber. Also true. Also true. Broadway here or Broadway here? I guess, Bol well, Bolshoi or, well, they're kind of similar. I have a decent amount of chops here if we want them. Meh. That'd be like a whole chart. <laughs> did we get St. Basil? We did, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. I don't need art museums. We have so many wildcard uh, slots for our art that we'll earn. Um... I was uh, forever ago. I was thinking about a farm. Uh, excuse me, a farm triangle here, but now I'm looking at seaside resort potential. Let's go there. I'm glad you're here, Abed. Have a wonderful day if you're if you're ducking out of here. Thank you for hanging out, as always. All the tourism. We're up to 365. I learned this yesterday, Quirion. <laughs> I did not know this until yesterday. When you build Stonehenge, after having founded a religion, what do you receive? Apparently an apostle. Chat taught me that yesterday.
Learned it 20 seconds ago playing your Ethiopia game. I love that. That's awesome. So like here, this is technically not eligible as a seaside resort, but it still functions as one. And it's because we built it before chopping the woods. Oh, Christo is unlocked. Oh, I, I can wait till this is done. But then we want to be building it. No, you get a profit if you don't have a religion founded. Can't really do much here, huh? Are we going to pop our religion? I don't know. It's a good question. <laughs> I very well may not, which is kind of funny. This is so risky. I'm not doing it. All right. Into the industrial era. Use my city to hide, you coward. That's my job. Does Christo counter the religion penalty to tourism? So what happens is um, your is when guide. your religious tourism. So talking talking about tourism from relics and talking about tourism from um, founding your holy city, which is something we're missing out on, by the way. But it's pretty insignificant. Um, it that's the type of tourism that um, that that gets halved at the Enlightenment. So you lose this, you lose half of that tourism here, um, but then Christo uh, makes it so that your output from relics and holy cities is not diminished by other cities with the Enlightenment. So this, this negates it. Coinage. Trade routes are a thing we have. We can go ahead and take indoctrination. I don't know that I'm actually doing this. Uh, and then the final is unlocks dark summoning a city project that provides a lot of faith when active upon completion uh, raises the amount of loyalty damage done by cultists. Interesting. Um, hmm. And what else do we want here? We can do Leanne, get these. And I'll just hold one, I guess. Golden for him. 26 of 210. So we can go, I think we'll go to the Cold War. I don't know why these are getting so confused. Yeah, I think we'll just bypass um, the next big government. I don't want it. And we're going to need to buy some more builders. Should have bought him last turn before the era change. Have I ever watched the series The Chi? I have not. I have not. Should I? A really weak church, obviously, but it's a little bit of tourism versus just planting a random woods there. Mm. 
now we have Earth Goddess, and that's always a good indicator that you're at breathtaking. The other being Nicolas Cage. More tourism. Bye, Thalia. Thank you for hanging out. Appreciate you being here and have a wonderful day. If I don't see you tomorrow, have a good weekend. Is the best Civ for religion relic tourism game with Void Singers? Uh, yeah, Poland and Congo do have stronger relics, so that's uh, that's pretty pretty smart. Oh, was it Keanu? Oh, it was Keanu. Ah, I ruined my own joke. Sad. Ruined my own joke. Favorite Civ to play as? It, it It's generally like Russia, Persia, but I, I like the smattering of, of different Civs that are in the game. Uh, makes me happy to be able to play them all. I also really like Japan. Reasons being obvious. Japan's pretty good. So how much are the, um, like if I wanted to try to get this city, how much are they? They're only 170. So 10 loyalty. The city, I, I, I like don't even, is this even doable? I have to like send a bajillion at once. Oh, they're normally 200. Oh, theology discount. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. It seems pretty cheap. Seems pretty cheap to me. Well, but she is Eleanor. Right? Uh, this might be an interesting spot for Broadway. Wait. Put the district there. I'll put Broadway here. Uh, because of all the, t the extra culture we're going to get on, on this. Versus all my other cities are pretty busy. Oh. Okay, I didn't mean to chop those then, I guess. I, I mean, the relics are fine, but it seems counterproductive to spend faith to make faith, even though it seems pretty reasonable. I mean, it seems strong, but it doesn't kick in. Like, y your ability to gain relics doesn't happen until the industrial era. So it doesn't feel that great to me. Uh, 
Uh, and then Mark. just in, just in case you were worried, uh, wondering if I was um, full of malarkey or not, with the extra tourism that we get from Earth Goddess here, we can look at this tile and see that it is in fact generating eight tourism. Six of this tour, six of this faith is from the Rock Hewn Church itself, and two is from Earth Goddess. So those things do stack in, making uh, Earth Goddess a pretty no-brainer pick for uh, Menelik, which is great. Sergeant McGreedy, welcome in. Thanks for the follow. Do the Void Relics count towards religious tourism? That's a good question, and I don't know. Uh, where's my where's my engineer? Definitely want these seaside resorts kicking in. This could actually be a park if I get rid of that. City unpowered, we don't really care. Two turns on computers. Time for another park, I think. I don't care about their housing. I'm not getting them a granary. Just do that, I suppose. Kind of, kind of a sweet national park. Oh, I miss the movement on Monumentality so much. French Elnor with Void Singers. Flip some cities with Void Relics. That's kind of fun. I like that. Been wondering, does planting woods um, affect negative climate change in Civ 6? No. Um, chopping a bunch of woods can create droughts. Is what happens. C cubed. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Is what can happen, rather. Next turn computers, so 25% bonus to our tourism. Um, yeah. Could crank out rock bands at some point soon, too. What was our first park? It was Pantanal. The good thing about computers, war is hell. So up to 535 tourism now. So 33 of 222. Let's see how it goes. Hi, Akio. Hello, hello. Um, and then we can come down here for steel, but I'm mostly coming down this side for um, stuff to deal with barbs with. Because, <laughs> yeah, there's not anything else I want really up here. I don't think.
1870 for the next one. We'll buy another park next turn. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I, I very rarely get uh, feedback praising the way that I pronounce things, but it uh, makes me very happy. Thank you. That could be a seaside resort. Oh, I did it wrong. Oh, well. That's fine. We got plenty of spots for parks. I do want a woods there, though. Let's go chop that woods. GDR barbs? Why why would you say those words? Why why? Why, Ordos? It seems cruel. Nine turn Petra available? Lol. I guess that should be a park. It's fine. <laughs> Excellent. Good to hear. What are the odds we still have barbarians down here? Pretty high, right? They're probably super high. I need builders here. Monumentality, why did you end... I needed you for like 20 more turns. No! <laughs> Niter! Right where my Bolshoi was gonna go. At least I built that. We can just distribute this art kind of haphazardly. I built the Diplo Quarter in this game. It's right here. It's giving me two niter per day. Uh, I didn't build the buildings. Uh, I, I decided that, like, okay, so looking at this, the buildings worth two gold, four science, and four faith. Uh, I instead built a shrine, which was worth two culture and five faith. Felt like that was a better deal. This can be a park. I want one. I want it. Zon, thank you for gifting us up. Welcome in Akio. <laughs> Welcome back for three months. Dig it. Can buy the Diplo Quarter buildings? I mean, huzzah? Spend 600 gold to get to, to, to pay itself back in 300 turns. <laughs> I don't want it. It's just not that good. <laughs> it just doesn't seem to do much. I'm open to it. I want it to be good. But every time I've I've gone to like look at it, um It just hasn't it doesn't seem like it does anything.
Yeah, that's fair, Matthew. Okie dokie. Kind of done with this beautification project. Suppose we still need some love down there. Dreams of the Void are as glorious as they are barbarian filled. Things are starting to go up somewhat quickly. We got three that turn. Long ways, long ways to go though, uh, turn wise. I I still feel pretty good that this is going to be sub two hundred, but we'll see. We'll see. I could be wrong on that. But anyways, we're gonna go ahead and put a cut in the video for now. Um, I think we're gonna need a whole another one to finish it up. So if you've been watching over on YouTube, thank you so much for watching, and we will see you all in the next one.